Steel Knights by um, Cy Wamvats and Anchor, which um, are two different people. But hey, whatever. Co-developing seven-day roguelikes. We'll see how that goes. Uh, hey guys, Game Hunter here, and we're playing a game that's um, about Knights of Steel, I guess. Uh, you wake up in a peaceful slumber of cryo and stumble out into the cold metal floor of the staging... Staging... Am I reading that? Uh, this is a browser game, by the way. By the way, this is a browser game. Um, yeah, this feels odd. Maybe maybe I should just read the in-game manual. Like, why is this here? Can I, like, press buttons? Hey, hey, you know what? This is This looks a lot like that one game that I played called the Endless Dungeon Golden Age thing. So, uh, in-game manual, anyway, we got movement, pick up, shoot. Oh man, we get to shoot equipped guns in this game. This game does more than, than just the normal one. Uh, assault rifle, shotgun, pulse repeater, laser combine. Um, anyway, I guess we'll learn those weapons as we fire them. It's more interesting that way. Uh, used to increase defense against enemies that share that core's color. Aligned... Green core nullifies from the green jelly, but damages it from a yellow jelly. Um, well, at least now we know that green and yellow are opposite colors. Uh, let's see. Survive. Complete the missions in the three portals. No saving when your character dies. They're dead. Play carefully if you want to survive. Stay healed and don't take chances. Maybe worth chatting rather than trying to kill everything in sight. Okay. Let's go ahead and start up our game. We're going to be calling ourselves... Um, I tin run. I I I turn on. That that works too. And we're gonna be male because obviously I turn on is the name of a, of a guy. I mean, really now. Select an SK suit type. Wow, there's a lot of them. Um. Well, I love speed. Speed it is. Ho ho. And we are we are a guy. I think that's us. I hope that's us. I'm just going to talk to you. Your partner says you can go ahead and pick which mission we do next. If you want to go over the briefing again, check your mission log. And this is the mission log. Um, whew, I think I have read these sorts of things before, so let's go ahead and just do it in this game too. For a moment there is nothing but the still, untouched emptiness of space. Then, with a sharp burst of light and the impression of sound where there was none, the shape of a reflective white vessel slides into view. <clears throat> Stamped along one side, the initials SK are visible. Also dots, but you know, whatever. The synaptic kinetic suits worn by special military forces are unique to one branch, drawing them the names SKs among their colleagues. Each high-tech battle suits are designed to adapt and learn, making the user progressively stronger with each battle. Made of plexi steel, they weigh far less than conventional armor, whilst maintaining a suitable protection, but only a few individuals are trained in their use, due to the extreme cost of each one. Because of this, the SKs are dispatched only to the toughest of missions, and whilst the military shorthand for their equipment has become to define them, the population at large has another name for them. The Steel Knights. Okay, so that was that. Um, and then there's the staging point. Oh my, this is... Whew, a lot of information. Um, three days, things, uh, screen flickers. <laughs> Just reading topic sentences here. Um, yes. Planet's name's Malador 12. So, we're looking for some kind of thing going on. I guess we're just trying to just deal with... Ah, oh, here we go. The pair of you have a simple brief. Discover what has happened aboard the Thunderchild, which is, I guess, a, a ship. There we go. Oi! I, you know, down to the dig site. Maybe we can enter the dig site. Maybe we could enter Malador 12. Or maybe we could enter also the Thunderchild. Uh, this leads to cryo storage. Come back when you complete your mission. All right. Um, well, this is like a detective game, I guess. So we're gonna start in the we're gonna start in the dig site. Actually, dig sites are great for 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 that sort of thing. Mission log updated. 
As soon as the effect of the teleport wears off, you feel it. The crushing pressures of something out there deep inside the dig site trying to sense your presence. So, uh, yes, something going on. Never had any choice of their own from the moment they arrived. <laughs> your escape protects you from the advances of the alien mind. So, that's why we can survive out here. Alright, so in any case, yeah, I'd, this is the weirdest text down here. I don't I don't know why it's there. Find appropriate... Oh, man, I don't have ammo at all. I don't have the... Okay, but I do have a lance, which is a sidearm, and it, it does a thing, so we will do fight that. Um, and kill things, and perhaps deal damage enough so that enemies die. That would certainly be awesome. Small med pack. Small med pack Gonna go ahead and get that med pack. I am so glad this game has the ability to have med packs. Cores, blue cores. Um, what are you? Can I talk to you? There's no one to talk to, but there is an evac pack. Evac pack! Evac a pack. Um, select items to use. Right, so I have the pulse repeater and the shotgun and the laser combined all just kind of here. Alright. That's cool. What is this? Walks down the stairs. I can walk back up the stairs. Sweet. All right. Well, I think I will try to fully explore this area. And what are you? Can I? Oh man. Maybe I should have let that egg finish. <laughs> Whoops. Um, and you're a Fromelian, which is some sort of um, frost-bitten Camelion. And you're a yellow jeller. Yellow jeller. Yellow jeller. Finally, a piece of headgear that I can wear. Light visors, letting see things going egg, egg hatches. Larval bubbles. And that, that was the end of that. <laughs> Man, more eggs. What's with all these eggs? Are you going to try to fight me? I think you're going to try to fight me. That's, in other words, I want to stay away from you, more or less. Although, perhaps just fighting these things, because they keep on randomly just popping up everywhere. It's not a bad idea either. Just free experience sort of thing. So the mission log happened. Eggs, hundreds if not thousands of eggs. I was already starting to notice about that. And where there are eggs, there are the um, egg incubators. And also, perhaps, um, you know, frying pans. Because, man, I am, I am a dude who really likes eggs I could just you know if, if you were allowed well I guess you're technically allowed but but if it were sensible to go ahead and eat like eggs three times a day chicken eggs of course because I don't really know anything else but uh, yes if just anything else that sort of going on there uh, man like Denny's Grand Slam they, they serve it 24 hours a day and gosh darn it I could, oh my goodness, okay, so in other words, I don't want these things to actually um, hit me at all, because when they do, oh my goodness, suddenly they're a lot harder. So we're just going to go ahead and use a small med pack, and that healed me completely, completely, okay, I can't look at stuff, shotgun shells, so I can start using shotgun for a while. Charge your laser combine? Sure, sounds like a good good time to do stuff um, speaking of which let's see fire arm and then the laser combine uh, how much darn it things tears charge combines can I how many times can I ch so is there any reason not to okay so eventually it runs out that's that's perhaps to be expected um, Yes, so uh, let's see, shotgun, I'm just going to pull up the shotgun because, yes, we should probably do that. Uh, I do have a red core, let's just go ahead and equip that. Yeah, look at that thing, that thing would that thing would be a nasty little guy because he keeps attacking constantly. You are a dude, you're a dude, right? That, oh, you're a beat clip for beating clips, clip beaters. What are you? You're a robot. Oh my goodness. Robots hurt. Wow. Oof. That is some powerful attack. And uh, killing eggs, pretty much. 
So now we're walking down some more stairs, and so we know it's like the walls are bleeding. Oh man, yes, your feet is like ground underneath. Your feet is like powder. Perhaps at one time this place was the body of some behemoth monster. Well, perhaps that's still the case. That would be kind of nasty, wouldn't it? Missing attacks, stuffs, um, and you're yellow. Well, I know yellow doesn't uncomplement red, so. Mission log. Oh man, I fell down a hole. I fell down a hole. Fire rages on this floor, slowly spreading outward and consuming everything slowly. Shisuke Kate is taking a lot of punishment, but even its technological wizardry can't fend off the blaze forever. You have to skim the edge and make your way as you quickly as you can to the floor below. Trusting that your emergency teleport will evacuate. Yes. Okay. So, yeah, lots of slimes. What's with all the slimes? Am I going to slowly take damage here if I'm not careful? More beat clips. I'm going to go ahead and guess that that's for the... I have no idea. Let's see if this works. Okay, so yeah, that that works. All right, so that's my that's my assault rifle attacker. Aha! You are dead. You are a light visor. I'd like to kind of get back actually to the. Oh my goodness, robots! Oh, yeah, I should probably just attack you with normal attacks. Sniper rifle, oh my goodness, sniper rifle. Um, sniper rifle, with any luck, is a lot like the assault rifle, but, um, haha, -ha. but, you know, better, basically. And you were defeated, defeated, and you also had body armor, which is amazing, because I need body armor sometimes. Can't get around all the time just doing crazy craps. Um, pulse capsule. So I think pulse capsule is actually for pulse repeater. So what do you know about that? Um, oh, gee whiz. Wilkers. Okay, phew. Uh, this would be a good opportunity, however, to go ahead and use one of my several small med packs. Combat helmet. Combat helmet. Um, I think I will use it. I don't even really notice the difference in uh, attack styles anyway so and you're sleeping you're sleeping I should probably attack you from afar yeah I'm gonna kill you from afar and you didn't even have anything dog blast did um, so yeah okay let's just go ahead and freaking robots man freaking robots where are they even coming from and why are they coming from there I mean clearly it's a jelly and not, you know, Constantinople. Um, in any case, let's just, oh, blast it, blast it, dag, blast it. Okay, phew. Whew. Oh, I need to pay more attention to the possibility that there are things out there that I am not aware of sometimes. And, you know, well, sometimes you just got to take things as it is. Oh, man, mission log updated the spawn from the eggs hatch at the very sight of you spewing forth larvae that scramble but, but these things may be small but they attack in numbers should you fall they would be over you like a piranha um ground dwelling piranha of course water breathing piranha would um kind of just flop around mindlessly so yes that's that's pretty much all i had to say there can I at least kill you? Cool. Oh, my goodness. Um, uh, let's go ahead and use a med pack. Yes! Use a med pack. Oh, blasted. You are also feeding off of them. Must kill you now before that becomes a, a super problem. Darn it! Stop feeding! Stop feeding! Stop it right now! Stop feeding. And they're also kind of fast. Great. Um, yeah. Oh boy. Well, let's just try to kill you as best I can here. Get the flashlight. Um, can I just, like, do I use the flashlight? Page up, page down. Where, there's the flashlight. So there's the flashlight, and it's being a flashlight now. Um, 
shotguns running low on ammo so instead I'm going to stick out the uh, sniper rifle here. sniper rifle I'm just gonna shoot you two to death medium med kit wow I've been using the smalls and I think that's a way out now so I'm looking for the big bad I guess Phew! Well, thank goodness that egg was defeated. That was one tough egg right there. That that was a real wowzers of an enemy. That was about the hardest boss I've ever had to fight ever in the history of forever. And this is still going on. This is... Wow. It's just still going on. Still enemies. You're a jelly. Phew, you're a dead jelly now. <laughs> And you're a robot. You're a robot. Robots must die. There we go. Much, much better. Oh boy. Um, you're the Formelians. You're not so bad. So what am I looking at here, though? Um, oh, blasted. Dag blasted. Um, oh yeah, body armor. Hooray for body. I didn't actually look at this. This is oh, that's an acid trap. Well, wow, that sucks really bad. I don't suppose I was wearing anything that caused it to to, to spring on me quite poorly or, or whatever. Um, man, I really wish there was auto run this game. You're still running, huh? Just running about there, avoiding how to maybe go about your business. Number one or number two, am I right? Am I right? Am I right? Sometimes, sometimes not. So I think that was it. Oh, crap. We're still going on. <laughs> I thought that was going to be it. The feeling of something pressing is in your, in your, into your mind can be felt again. With effort, you push it away, but now you know deep down that it will return in soon. So we still have more to deal with. Oh, my goodness. Um... Perhaps, let's see, how many charges of things do I have? I only got 10 pulse capsules, so that's something to worry about. This lance is awfully powerful. It's, it's also very knight-like, I gotta say. So, you know, steel knights. Oh, wow, that's a lot of enemies. And, um... Crap. Let's try to get you into position one at a time. And maybe use a um, small med pack. There we go. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to really go to the title screen. Why would you think that? Why would you ever think that? Okay, so we're doing okay, Lee, so far. Those groups of, of those can be quite nasty. Gotta say, quite nasty. Looks like I leveled up. Not really paying attention to that part so much, but you know what happens. <laughs> so, all right, here we are. Ha ha! Oh wow. Um, fireballs. Fireballs can be nasty. So can the larvas. At least the larvas. Wow, <laughs> that flame just died. What do you know? Is there is there any more? Cool. I wonder if those eventually would replenish, but I'm being, like, stupid about it. I don't know. So we walk down the stairs. The source of so many fires begins to come in, become apparent. As you round a corner, your path becomes somewhat blocked. At what first glance, another fire but then shifts and makes a dive toward you, <laughs> forcing you to backpedal, some kind of flame elemental. Well, that explains those total things that we saw just around the area. Forces you to take another path. Circling around an intersection, you come behind it and fire, taking by surprise, forcing you to move on quickly. Okay, well, we are moving on very quickly. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, wow, that's a lot of fireballs. Um. Wait, they're attacking each other? Is that what's going on? I think that's what's going on. So, that happens sometimes. Well, that's good, because that means I don't have to fight you. And if I don't have to fight you, all the better. You're a creeper. Oh my goodness. Do I remember creepers from the last game? I remember creepers from the last game. They totally multiplied all the time. And if I didn't have the ability to regenerate, I would have been totally screwed. Um, can I attack, just plain old attack you guys? I guess I can. Um, I am worried about the possibility of taking extra damage. But it eh, looked like that was okay. So. <laughs> Let's just go ahead and continue on. And that was an acid trap. 
That was an acid trap. It looks like it didn't hurt me except in terms of literal damage. So that's not too bad. And there's just about 100,000 eggs. We should probably just kill these immediately. Um, maybe I might. Darn it. Well, at least I wasn't taking. Oh, blah. Larvas must die first. Darn it. There we go. There we go. Okay. Everybody is happy. Everybody's happy. Especially me. Because, you know, I just I got the best time in my whole life going on. I am a blue haired devil kin man that absolutely feasts on the flesh of evil alien larva. <laughs> um You know, it's it's pretty much how puberty goes half the time. The other half is these guys that are really annoying. And where did you come from, Mr. Flame Man? Mr. Flame Man, why are you spreading so much, Mr. Flame Man? Wow. If, uh, wow. Okay. Flame Man, you are really spreading around all over the place. Flame Man. Stop, stop spreading so much, Flame Man. It's, it's really getting kind of annoying, Flame Man. Flame Man. Why, why must you be so insistent, Flame Man? Are you at least, okay, at least I'm getting experience for flaming up here. But I'm also taking damage, which is not cool. That is not what happens when you want to try to go ahead and, and uh, get through flames sometimes. We're just going to have to go downstairs, yeah. So, that's what happened. And you're a flame, and I must kill you <laughs> immediately. If I, if I didn't know that last time, I know that this time. Immediately. You changed color, but not in really time to do anything. So <laughs> that's, that's what happened. You didn't really do anything important. What else is... Oh, wow. You deal a lot of damage. Is that because I'm wearing a red core? It is because I'm wearing a red core. And that's an acid trap. And uh, those hurt a lot. So, you know, you got to be careful about those sometimes. Robots. Robots. Double robot time. Um, I guess I'll just use my ammo on this. Darn it! Stop picking up stuff and then using it potentially. Um, especially when it's something that I could be using. You know, it's not, not a cool thing to do, guy. Um, several items. Wow. Just lots of stuff sitting here. Pulse destroyer, pulse piercer, pulse weapons. Man oh man. Look at all that stuff. Uh, I had the repeater and the piercer. The, so the destroyer is the best one there. And uh, in terms of rifles and things like that. Uh, was that the whole floor? I think that was really the whole floor. So, uh, I'm just going to shoot you, I guess. till you die. You must die! Um, darn it, Blightwing. Looks like I didn't hit you total. Phew! Looks like I leveled up. That's also important sometimes. For certain fellows of the certain fellow variety. Um gotta use these and then we go poof suddenly we got healing mission log has been updated then there's a robot just kind of sitting right on sparking electrical elemental causes some trouble but you manage to turn it to your advantage by leading it into the midst of another egg cache and allowing the resulting monster smackdown to kill two burns with one stone wow so that happened and it worked out just fine I guess I am picking up crap loads of stuff just like in the old other game. It's uh, it's interesting when that happens, but I don't know. It's kind of weird too, because you never really run out of equipment, and you have no reason to hold on to most of it. But I mean, what else? What else are you gonna do? There's there's little reason not to just kind of have it anyway. Um, I guess I haven't tried talking to the robots yet. Maybe I should try talking to the robots. Ooh, red core increases damage. Wait, oh, it's always increased damage. And then there's this green core, which just... I don't even know what it's for. Let's find out, huh? Maybe it added to the dodge. Did it DDG? Is that damage? Maybe that's damage. That could very well be the question mark of damage. You changed color to, uh, oh, okay, those guys will specifically change to the opposite color in order to, uh, you know, kill. Impressively. Um, 
Wow, you guys really pack a punch, don't you? So we're going to have to med pack this up in order just to survive. And dig site 10, man. Oh, that's the same thing as last time. Kill that flame immediately because they just start spreading. Otherwise, I, um, finally. Okay, you're dead. Phew. Phew. you. Um, does the green core regenerate me? Is that is that what I'm seeing? No, that didn't. Really, well, maybe it happened. Maybe it didn't. Um, I'm still in my learning phase. And you're a spark. Sparks must also die. That's what else. What else can be said? There's it's just a bunch of death in this game, pretty much. Who pulse capsules for the ability to capsule my pulses? Oh wow! Oh wow! You just killed me for infinite damage because I was wearing a green core. Well, well, that's what happened. Oh my goodness. Enter your player name. Um, Game Hunter. There we go. Connected. Oh wait, I want to see the all-time high scores, man. All-time high scores. Well, wow, people did a lot better than I did. <laughs> wow, yes, definitely including a bunch of people that just simply completed missions all over the place. So anyway, yeah, I guess we'll leave it at that. Today's top scores, did I at least... Yes, look at that. I am number one today. So anyway, this has been Game Hunter, playing some Steel Knights, and um, I suggest playing it more because there's certainly more content in here, and especially if you're a plot-driven type player, that there's lots of plot here, so definitely work that into it. So uh, yeah, until... The uh, next time, we'll be checking out more roguelikes from 7-Day Roguelike in the year of 2012. Uh, until then, keep playing those roguelikes, guys, and take care.